Hi everyone, today I want to show you a feature in Schoology that allows you to record an audio or an audio video very, very simply built right within the Schoology platform. So I am going to navigate first to my amazing test course where I like to play with all these features and I'm going to go not to my materials but to my updates. So this might be useful if, say, you were going to be out for a day and you wanted to record a message to your students or you just felt like for your learners it would be better, maybe it's in um, a language class or maybe they're younger um, and you want them to hear your voice and see you as opposed to reading the text. So what I'm going to do, if you see all of these icons here available to you for updates, this one here that's got I guess that's supposed to be a microphone. Um, it says audio video recording. So all I have to do is click go. And do I want them just to hear my voice or do I want them to see me as well? I'm gonna click audio and video for this example. And there's the video, that's me. Okay, and so I'm just gonna hit start recording. Hi students, how are you today? I hope everything is going well. The sun is shining, the birds are chirping, et cetera, et cetera. Have a wonderful day. And I click stop recording. So there's my little video. And I press insert recording here. There it is right there. And now it won't let me just post. I do have to put some text in this text box. So I'm going to say, um, watch my video. Okay, and post. So now um, as students log in, after a few minutes, I believe that that link turns into a thumbnail. Um, so let's pause that, give it time to convert itself and I'll show you. So as you can see, after some time, um, the video turns into a thumbnail. So it's really kind of fast and simple for students to look at that feed and see that video. They can just click, it opens up, and they can even make it full screen if they want. And they have the entire message right from you. Hi, students. So there we go. Um, this is a really great way to just have to put a face, give them that audio, and have that check in on an update. But the really fun and exciting thing doesn't have to end there. You can also create assignments where the students can create their own audio video recordings. So I'm going to show you that because I am a student in um, Joanna's amazing test course as well. I don't think hers is called amazing test course. Maybe it's magnificent or something to that effect. Joanna's training test course. There we are. So she has posted a discussion question assignment. And as a student in her class, I have the opportunity to make a response. So see my little feature there? There I have that microphone again, the audio video recording. So I can, as a student now, post an audio video. And same features for the students. I hit start recording. Hi, Mrs. Shemansky. My answer is that it is a wonderful day today and bye. Stop recording. Insert recording. It's right there. And as similar, this is my response. You have to have some text there to post it. And I hit post. And so Joanna, as the teacher, will be able, once that video you know, converts again, she'll be able to view that response and any response from any of the students. So um, that's a really great feature for any class or content that would be best um, you know, done in a spoken word. So I think that's everything. You can just look for that little microphone, the audio video recording for teachers. You're going to access it in the updates and um, in this discussion question for students. Have a great day, everybody.